worst time in my life. My eyes can see. Good morning, everybody, and welcome to my studio. So today is actually chucking it down with rain and it's a really dismal day but I'm actually finding beauty in the rain because it's so peaceful and relaxing just to look out onto the fields with it just all coming down. So, so this morning so far I've done a little bit of journaling and a bit of bible study just while I'm having my smoothie. I just found that this is a really good way to like set the day off and just get you in a good place mentally. I find that it gives me a bit more of a balanced view of the day. Um, so sometimes I'll be stressing out so much about different things but when I sit down and have that time it puts everything into perspective of what is really important. It just gives me a good vibe for the rest of the day. Um, so next I've got my big to-do list and basically later on I'm going to be meeting a couple of clients with a couple of paintings because they're not sure which one they would like so i'm gonna meet up with them and show them a couple for them to choose from but basically i need to get those paintings out make sure that they've got hangings on the back and that they are ready to go so that's what i need to do now So I thought I'd just like talk you through exactly what I'm doing. So I have put backs on all the paintings, but right now what I'm doing is because the clients want to look at both paintings, but they also want to take it home today, I want to make it so that it's still nicely packaged, but so that you can get it in and out easily which is actually proving a lot more difficult than I thought it was going to be. So I'll show you like what I've sort of come up with. Using foam board I've put like sides on it so that it can still stay like a shape and um, so that the painting can come in and out but also so that it's wrapped nicely. Just doing that one has taken me about 40 minutes. Are done. So that I'd introduce you to my new plant which is called Clarence and he is our new family member. Sometimes, sometimes I wonder, I wonder could we, well could we ever be? He's never, he's never felt thunder, he's never seen hell, but it's like home to me, it's like home to me. So while I just finished off my brew, which is delicious, may I add, it's the Detox Pucker Tea, and I've never tried it before, that's the first time I tried it, and it was beautiful, it's like, um had notes of like spiciness to it, it's really really nice. Anyway, <laughs> what I wanted to show you today was a new addition to my outfit and that is my beautiful watch. The watch face, which is really really beautiful, that is actually an original oil painting. How cool is that guys? Um, people talk about wearable art but this is like literally wearing an original painting on you at all times That's like so cool. So I chose this one because obviously it's like beautiful florals And I just love that impressionistic feel to it when it just catches the light You can just see all the tiny little brush strokes and texture that the oil paint has left and it just is so so beautiful Feel free to have a little browse on their website and see what different designs they have I'll pop the link in the description box so you can go and take a little gander yourself. So anyway, Let's get on with the next job. And tell you everything I want to leave. I threw it away. Some things never change. I love like a frozen river. You love 
girl like a burning sun mm, I'm not to your touch Come my darling A little closer Rest your head up on my shoulder Come my darling It's getting colder Lay right here till the night is over. And everything I once held to leave, I threw it away. Some things never change. Love like a frozen river You love like a burning sun mm, I melt to your touch Melt to your touch Melt to your touch So I've done a couple of layers on the painting behind me um, Well actually probably about three now in acrylic um, so it's nowhere near finished yet, I'm not happy with it at all yet. I just kind of had fun with this one really, instead of having a set like thing I want by the end of it. I just wanted to have fun and express myself, so I feel like I've done that. So yeah, that's probably all the painting I'll get a chance to do today. But there's a bunch of us that have set up a page called the Studio Market, and that is going to have tons of original artwork on there that you can buy through Instagram. And so yeah, go and check it out if you're not already. So I'm going to be putting up three pieces on Monday and I haven't yet decided exactly which pieces I'm going to put up. So that's what I'm going to do now, I'm going to sit and have a look at what pieces I've got to sell and what would work quite well on Instagram. Head to the studio market on Instagram and go and check out what we have for sale. feel like every attic has a buzz in it. At the end of this cigarette is probably the closest I'll ever get to a star. Except maybe you with milky ways in your hair and comments strung out of your eyes. So for the studio market sale on Monday, I'm thinking possibly this piece this piece and also this little one here so I'm thinking about doing either those three or this seascape which is called salt skin along with these two triptychs so I'm not sure whether to go down sea route or the floral route so so let me know in the comments which ones you think I should go for for Monday's studio market sale and you'll have to check back on Monday to see which one I went for so I've put my casual shirt on and I'm gonna go and have a meeting so I've just met up with the clients and they loved both the paintings so much that they actually took them both which is really amazing and I'm so thankful to them and um, they were such a nice family so now we're just heading back and we might go for a little walk I'll never be 